in a breakthrough that merges abundant domestic resources with cutting-edge engineering, China has transformed what was once considered mining waste into a powerful energy source. Thorium, long a byproduct of rare earth extraction, is now being harnessed as nuclear fuel in a molten salt reactor located in the arid expanse of the Gobi Desert. This development marks a critical milestone in the nation's energy strategy, reducing reliance on imported uranium and enhancing national energy security. Thorium possesses energy potential equivalent to three tons of coal per unit. China vast reserves, including those at the Bayan Obo mine alone, could sustain long-term reactor operations. Unlike conventional nuclear plants that require massive water supplies for cooling and are limited to coastal sites, this new reactor uses high-temperature molten salt as both coolant and fuel carrier. Operating stably at 700 degrees Celsius, it needs no external water and can be deployed in remote inland regions. Safety is another cornerstone of the design. In the event of malfunction, the molten salt solidifies automatically, locking radioactive materials in place and eliminating the risk of leakage. This passive safety feature represents a fundamental shift from traditional reactor paradigms. Beyond electricity generation, the reactor's high temperature output opens doors to industrial applications. It can supply heat for coal chemical processes, boost hydrogen production efficiency by 40%, and integrate with solar energy systems to form resilient hybrid grids. The project also accelerates domestic manufacturing. Critical components such as molten salt circulation pumps and steam generators, once exclusive to Western firms, are now being produced locally after passing over 10,000 hours of testing. Advanced materials like nickel-based superalloys and nuclear-grade graphite, previously imported, are now in mass production. China Roadmap outlines a three-phase rollout. Experimental validation by 2025, a 100 megawatt demonstration unit by 2035, and full commercialization by mid-century. With the first phase already complete, the transition from laboratory success to industrial scale is underway. This innovation is more than a technical achievement. It is a strategic pivot. By turning a discarded resource into a cornerstone of clean energy, China is not only securing its own power future, but also positioning itself as a global leader in next-generation nuclear technology.